Well, I mean, the experiment predates quantum physics by quite, you know, quite a few decades. Uh, it was first performed by Thomas Young um, in, I think, the early 1800s to demonstrate that light behaved like a wave. So he wanted to show that, in fact, light light wasn't part, like part had a particle nature, like considering, I think Newton suggested, uh, but it was a wave. So he kind of shone a uh, light, uh, or I think it was like sunlight coming through, <laughs> coming through the window, and he took a like a sheet of paper, whatever thick paper, poked two holes in it. They're slits. So you, you cut like thin slits in it and you let the light pass through. And if light is a particle, then what you should find is two, two strips of light on the other side. But what he found was a, a pattern of bright and dark. And in fact, the brightest part was in between where the two slits were. So this demonstrated that light obeys some sort of interference and acts like a wave. And if you did the same experiment with like water waves or sound waves, you would see the exact same pattern. So there's pretty conclusive evidence by, you know, early 1900s or 19th century standards. It's about as conclusive as you can get that, that light is a wave.